I'm now in downtown Lubbock at Two Docks talking to them about their awesome event they're having on Sunday for the first time ever, partnering with Live Oak Animal Hospital and SPCA for their adoption event. My name is Eric Cunningham. Uh, I'm one of the owners at both Live Oak Animal Hospital and Two Docks Brewing Company. Uh, and so we've got, a, we've got an event coming on that's going to kind of bring both of those businesses together. It's an adoption event and it's going to benefit the SPCA. We're going to try to get some dogs adopted and have a good time doing it. Um, Anna's going to tell you a little bit more about the details we've got going on. All right, so on Sunday, we're, going, we're looking to have everyone out between 2 and 5. There will be dogs available at the event for adoption, as well as many others online who will be available. Um, you can adopt dogs at this event. You can bring your own dogs from home. We will have many dog-friendly activities, like um, a dog-friendly beer, a dog photo booth, um, as well as many other things for sale, such as bandanas and um, training tips, things like that. So it will be a really fun event. Um, there will be multiple food trucks at this event and just all around a family, dog-friendly, uh, fun time for everybody. Um, Live Oak is putting this event on as part of our Live Oak Loves Lubbock campaign that we are doing this year. Um, we are partnering with multiple organizations around town to just kind of invest more in the community. Um, so for April, we're really shining our light on the SPCA to not only help them get dogs adopted, but also meet some of their financial needs on an ongoing basis. Um, Live Oak works pretty closely with them and we offer discounted services, things like that. So there are many, many, many pets can get uh, the veterinary services that they need. There will be an adoption fee. Um, the fee is $150, but this does include a spay or neuter voucher as well as all of the vaccinations included, um, heartworm prevention and flea and tick prevention. So these dogs will be fully vetted and, or at least have um, a voucher to do all of these things needed. Um, Live Oak, as well as many other clinics will provide these services on the vouchers. There's two things I love, dogs and beer, and bringing them together is a great idea, I think. So, uh, um, you know, I, I guess since we opened this brewery, that was something that I always thought would be a, a great marriage, is to be able to both give back to the community and have a good time while doing it. And so, you know, it's just natural since we, uh, you know, since I have Live Oak, since we have Live Oak and we have two docks, uh, bringing them together for an adoption event is just something that I think was, uh, I actually thought about that a long time ago. As soon as we opened the brewery, one of the first thoughts I had was that we can do an adoption event out here and find a lot of dogs home. So uh, it, it'll be fun. And this is, uh, Two Docks is normally a very dog friendly environment. And so uh, it just seemed natural. A two to five, and we're gonna have, uh, like she said, live music and food trucks uh, the whole day. And you know, uh, obviously if you wanna stay around after five o'clock, you're encouraged to. You can kind of look and see what dogs they have available for adoption. At this point, we um, cannot guarantee for sure which dogs will be there. We're hoping maybe every single one will be adopted before the event. That's always the hope. Um, so at this point, it's just kind of on an ongoing basis, like who is available, who will be able to make it to the event. And of course, we try to encourage um, only vaccinated dogs to come so it is safe for everybody. I think we're just going to kind of play it by ear and see, um, you know, if this if this works out well, then we'll probably try to do it every year. It definitely sounds like it's going to be a fun event. Whether if you have a dog or want a dog, brews and puppies, what more could you ask for and lots of things to do. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more Trends and Friends.